Hello, today's devotional can be found in Acts chapter 28, verse 9. So when this was done, others also, which had diseases in the island, came and were healed. Okay, when we take care of ourselves, then we are in a better position to t help the Lord take care of others. If we truly strengthen ourselves and allow the Spirit to be with us and do all things that we might be able to receive revelation from the Lord, the Lord will teach us how we can find others who are in need of his healing hands, others who are sick and afflicted, others who want to and can benefit from the healing that the atonement has to offer. Because the atonement's for everything. There's nothing it can't fix. But it will not rob people of their agency. Faith in the atonement will not rob people of their agency, and we cannot rob people of their agency. We cannot rob ourselves of our agency. We cannot. We should not do things because they are expected of us. We should do things because we want to. If we do things simply because they are expected of us, we won't learn anything and we won't find joy in anything. If we do things because we want to, we'll find joy in what we're doing and we'll learn much. And we will truly be healed if we just do things because we're expected to the Lord's not going to force us to be healed because he knows our hearts and if our hearts aren't wanting to be healed we're not going to be healed we cannot be afraid to seek healing because we don't have to remain sick forever the atonement ensures that we can become one with the Lord and we can become one with ourselves. We can be healed of all that holds us back from becoming better, if we so choose. Satan would have us believe that we cannot become better and must stick with our sicknesses, but that we can become better than we are. And with that said, I love you all so very much, and I say these things humbly in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen.